In general, humans live longer than most animals in the world. However, there are a handful of species out there that live substantially longer than other animals, and in some cases, a lot longer than humans too. If you stick around until the end of the video, you'll also learn about the only immortal animal on Earth. I hope you enjoy today's video. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any future videos. Today's number 10 spot goes to the Japanese koi. Koi fish are colorful, ornamental versions of the common carp. You've probably seen them in decorative ponds and parks or restaurants. The modern Japanese koi dates back to the early 1800s when Japanese rice farmers caught and bred wild, colorful carp to obtain the type of fish you see today. Koi can grow up to 3 feet in length and have an average lifespan of 25 to 35 years. However, some have been known to live much longer than this. A Japanese koi named Hanako claimed the record for longest life of a koi when it died at 226 years old, about seven and a half times the average lifespan. If you buy some of these fish as pets, you better plan on them being around for a while. Up next in the number 9 spot is the macaw. Macaws are beautiful, brilliantly colored members of the parrot family that have an average lifespan of 50 years but can live all the way past 70 years on some occasions. Macaws come in a wide variety of sizes, from 1 foot to 3.5 feet in height. Macaws naturally inhabit Central and South American rainforests where they thrive in the massive green canopies filled with colorful fruits and flowers. The birds' powerful beaks can easily crack open the nuts and seeds found in their home territory, and their tongues have a special bone inside of them that assists the birds in tapping into fruits. These impressive birds are very intelligent and some can even mimic human speech. Sadly, more and more species of macaw are becoming endangered as their populations are depleted through illegal hunting and poaching for the pet trade, as well as loss of habitat through deforestation. The African elephant takes the number 8 spot. You've probably heard the phrase, an elephant never forgets, but you may not have known that the African elephant lives an average life of 60 to 70 years. That's a long time to remember something. Not only do these elephants have great memories and a long lifespan, they are also the largest land animal to walk the earth. These massive beasts grow 8 to 13 feet tall and weigh in at 5 to 14,000 pounds. You do not want to get in their way, because even if they don't just squish you, they have tusks that can reach 6 feet in length that they could skewer you with. One reason these elephants live so long is because they have an unusually low rate of cancer. Only around 3% of them are diagnosed with it, and scientists are actually studying them in hopes of making a discovery that could help reduce the rate among humans. Number 7 goes to the longest living vertebrate, the Galapagos tortoise, which lives 100 years on average. The longest living of these tortoises lived to the ripe old age of 152 years. The Galapagos tortoises are actually the world's largest, with some reaching 5 feet in length and 550 pounds in weight. Sadly, these beautiful creatures' numbers are dwindling as most subspecies are either endangered or critically endangered as a result of overhunting by pirates, whalers, and merchants from the 17th to 19th centuries. Perhaps one reason these tortoises live so long is their simple and relaxed lifestyle. They spend an average of 16 hours napping every day and their extremely slow metabolism, along with large internal stores of water, mean they can actually go up to an entire year without eating or drinking. The Red Sea Urchin comes in at number 6 with a lifespan of 100 to 200 years. These spiky sea creatures reside in the northeastern Pacific Ocean from Alaska to Baja, California. They live off the coast in water up to 330 feet deep and are typically found in areas without extreme wave action. The urchin's mouth is located underneath its pointy body and it uses its mouth to scrape seaweed and algae off the seafloor to feed on. These urchins commonly live in groups of 5 to 10. One reason behind their lengthy lives is that they are rather uncomplicated and lack a brain and heart. I guess there's just less that can go wrong that way. Also, their plentiful spines help to protect them from their natural predators which include birds, some sea stars, and lobsters. In fifth place is the gooey duck, which has no relation to ducks at all. The name comes from a Native American tribe and originally meant dig deep, referring to the way that the clam burrows into the sea floor. These strange looking bottom feeders can grow up to 3 feet in length and live up to 165 years old. They usually live in a single place on the sea floor their entire life, partially buried in the sand to secure themselves there. They survive by sucking in water and filtering out plankton and vitamins. 
Surprisingly, in spite of how it looks, it is actually a delicacy in some parts of the world and costs around $30 per pound to purchase as food. I don't know about you, but I'm more than happy to take someone else's word that it tastes sweet and crunchy when you bite into it. Raw. The bowhead whale takes fourth place with a lifespan of over 200 years. These whales live predominantly in the Arctic and can reach 60 feet in length and 120,000 pounds in weight. To put that into perspective, the average school bus is 30 feet long and only weighs 25,000 pounds. These whales have large, durable skulls that can break through up to two feet of ice to surface for air. Unlike some other species of whale, bowheads are not very social and usually live alone or in small groups of up to five other whales. Contrary to what some people may think because of their dimensions, these whales don't eat anything anywhere close to their size. They are actually filter feeders and survive by consuming about two tons of plankton and crustaceans every day. Third place belongs to the Greenland shark, another huge sea creature, although not quite as huge as the bowhead whale. The Greenland shark has an average length of 20 feet and a weight of 2,000 pounds. This shark is known to eat pretty much anything it can get its mouth around, including fish, other sharks, eels, seals, jellyfish, sea urchins, squids, or even reindeer or caribou that stand too close to holes in the ice. This shark resides in the deeps of the ocean, usually about 4,000 feet down where the water's temperature is just above freezing. These sharks have basically no natural predators due to their size and habitat, so it is not surprising that they can live up to 270 years. The cold temperatures are enough to make anything sluggish, and the Greenland shark is sometimes called the sleeping shark because it moves around slowly when it isn't hunting. In second place is something you probably don't think of when you think of animals at all, much less animals that live a long time. The Antarctic glass sponge, which is indeed a member of the kingdom Animalia, can live an astounding 15,000 years. Obviously, no one was studying these sponges 15,000 years ago, but that is the current estimate of their lifespan by scientists who are studying them now. Two of the reasons these sponges live so long are because they grow extremely slowly and because they live deep in the Arctic oceans where there are very few things that will disturb them. The immortal jellyfish claims first place, and its name pretty much gives away the reason why. The jellyfish is biologically immortal, meaning that it can be killed by something such as another animal, but in theory it will never die of natural causes. It is able to do this because of its unique life cycle. Similar to other jellyfish, the immortal jellyfish begins life as a swimming larva before it settles down and gives rise to a colony of polyps which attach to the seafloor. However, all of the polyps formed from an immortal jellyfish are identical clones, meaning they are genetically the same animal. They also form a branching structure that isn't seen in other jellyfish before jellyfish known as medusa butt off of the polyps and begin swimming around until they mature. After maturing, they begin aggressively preying on other species of jellyfish. The secret to the immortal jellyfish's immortality is that if it is exposed to a physical assault, illness, or old age, it can revert to the polyp stage of its life and form an entirely new colony, which is still genetically identical to the original jellyfish, and this cycle can go on indefinitely, allowing it to live practically forever. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, comment below and tell me your favorite part, and make sure to like and subscribe so you know when the next video comes out. In the meantime, feel free to check out some of the other videos and playlists I have on my channel. Thanks again, and I'll see you all next time.